Hello everyone, I'm going to show you two new AI tools that have revolutionized research writing. You can now develop your literature review in a very short time and plagiarism free. Let us dive into them straight away. Kindly don't forget to like our video and share with friends. Also subscribe for more content from us. All right, gang, number one is this AI tool called Jenny. With it, you can generate literature review section of your research with citations that are real and directing to actual links. Go to Google search and search for Jenny AI. You will get multiple results, but go to the first one. I have also attached a link in the description. Now open the link. This is Jenny, a revolutionary AI for researchers. Let us start by creating an account which is all free. It is very easy to do. Click on Start Writing and a registration page with Open. Let us create account via Google Sign Up. Go through all the process and boom, you will have your account. Let us skip this for now. As you can see, the user interface is very easy to use. You can do so much with this tool. You can upload your documents and can use them while generating your article. You can also cite these documents uploaded into your articles. Now, to get the best, let us generate a research topic. You can use your research topic if you have one, but we can use ChatGPT to do this quickly. Go to Google and search ChatGTP, then go to the link and create an account. I have put the link in the video description. Now, in ChatGPT, I'm going to ask it to create five research topics on quantum computing. Now we have our research topics. Let us copy this into Jenny and see what we can create. It is about quantum algorithms. Paste the research topic in the tab and see the magic happen. Click Start Writing. Now the writing starts. Jenny is designed in the way that it brings a short paragraph. You review it, and if you find it appealing, you click Next. The goal is not to bombard you with useless paragraphs. So let us click Accept and continue. If by any chance you get a paragraph you don't like, just click on See Alternative button, and an alternative paragraph will be generated for you. You can continue this process until you are contented with the results. As you can see, we have citations automatically generated as well. Let us check it out. You can see that this citation is actually real and links to a real paper. This is the beauty of this AI tool. It also has an option for you to generate citations easily. Just highlight a paragraph you want to see citation for and then click on citations. Different papers will be generated for you in line with your paragraph. You can read through and select your preferred topic to quote in the citation. Once you approve, this gets cited to your document. There's an option for you to even cite your own documents on your computer. Just upload them or use already uploaded documents and link them into your paper. You can do this as many times as you wish. Just highlight a paragraph and choose citations, then follow the steps. Your references will be added down as you proceed. This tool is revolutionary and is going to fasten your research. In a free version of Jenny AI, you have a limit of 200 words on every article generated. You can just copy and open new area to proceed. Let us check out another topic and see what can be done. Open a new document and a tab will open as well. Let us use global warming as our research topic. Now the tool has started doing magic. Click accept and continue. And if you don't like the paragraph, just select to see alternatives. Still, you can add multiple references, but the tool also generates for you relevant citations which link to correct document. This tool was specifically designed for research, and so plagiarism checkers will not see it as plagiarism, and also AI checkers will not detect it. Let us test AI detector using Zero GPT. Let us copy our document and go to Google. Search Zero GPT, and then go to Zero GPT website. It is free to use. Paste the content. As you can see, our content is written by human. It is me and you that know the truth to this. Isn't this awesome? Now, the best way to make yourself appear more natural when generating those chunks of paragraphs, add in your natural filler words to break the chain, but still, zero GPT will not know. Let us check out this second tool for our research. It is called Open Read. Go to Google search and type in Open Read Academy. The link will come and you click to open it. Create an account which is still free to create. All you need is a Google Mail. A one-time password will be sent to your Google Mail. Open it and use it to verify your account. This is an AI search engine for mostly literature review citations for your research project. Let me search around quantum computing, specifically quantum algorithms. As you can see, we have a wide number of research papers related to our topic. You can read through and see which one is worth citing in your paper. This tool has a number of features, including a section for abstract where you just read through the abstract. 
You can also choose Espresso mode, which will go through the whole document and give you the most important points. Through this, you can know if the document is worth it or not. Another is Paper Q&Q. Here, you can ask any questions of your choice about the paper. For example, what are the highlights of this paper? As you can see, we have the most important highlights of this paper. You can ask as many questions as you please until you know exactly if the document is worth it or not. These tools are good for research and can make your work easy. Kindly use them to help you make research faster, but not to replace your thinking as research is the reason science grows. Kindly follow me for more tips and exciting topics. Thanks, gang.